The OZ745 is a video development platform based on the Zinc 7045 processor. Omnitech supply the hardware, design services, IP, reference designs and a board support package with the, with the board. Omnitech also supplies uh, software and firmware IP cores to further accelerate time to market. The board includes five 3G, H 3G SDI uh, inputs and outputs bi-directional, an SFP plus cage for 10 gig ethernet, composite analog input, HDMI in and out, and ethernet and USB support. There's an SD card for program and data, and the board includes Omnitech IP core called OSVP, which is the Omnitech Scalable Video Processor. That forms a core part of the Xilinx RTVE reference design. So on the screen here, we are displaying the bitstream that's programmed to show the reference design and in particular Omnitech's OSVP. So we're seeing here deinterlace, crop, color up sample, scaling, frame synchronization uh, and on-screen display. So for example this lower right image is showing the ability both to move and it's showing the keying through the mixing of one video with the underlying video and this is just done through a simple wireless connection. The board also can render a 2D graphics acceleration from Omnitech using QT graphics and the Linux process on the arm on the arm part of the 7045. That allows us to render a web page directly from the board which would include video elements such as these. So this web interface is just very simply demonstrating the uh, RTV uh, IP and the, uh, the Omnitech, Omnitech scalable video, video processor and so on the input side you can see all the parameters we can do motion detection and we can show where the motion is detected that allows us to do a superior deinterlace for broadcast video formats we can see the coefficients used in the resizing which allows us to experiment with the resolution that we get when we resize an image and then we have on-screen display controls capture controls but primarily the interface is there to allow the developer to exercise the various elements of the IP and integrate it with their own IP for their application. So on the OZ745 board we have five 3G SDI inputs and outputs. These are bi-directional for these four and this input allows us to analyse the physical layer of the incoming SDI signal to analyse the jitter, the phase jitter and the uh, rise and fall times of the waveform. The SFP plus cage allows the user to uh, integrate 10 gig ethernet or fibre channel support. There's an analogue composite input with decoder for analogue applications. There's HDMI in and out and then there's ethernet with two USB and further USB on the front. Okay, in addition to the standard video I.O., we also have an LVDS header which has 10 LVDS pairs allowing connection to a flat panel display for displaying resolutions up to 4K and this includes powering the panel as well as the signal.